Terminator Resistance. This was the biggest unexpected hit for me during the PS4 era. In fact, I can't think of another game that came out. Maybe Resogun. But I, I didn't know anything about Resogun going into it, so I, I can't really count that one. Terminator, I've always wanted there to be a good Terminator game. It's just never happened. Going back all the way to like the Sega Genesis and the Nintendo, just never been a good Terminator game until this came out. Taeon, the developer who's known for making rail shooters, decided to try their hand with this and they, in my opinion, succeeded. It's not a perfect game, but it's good enough. And it blends all things Terminator, Terminators 1 and 2, it doesn't even remotely take into account anything that happens after Terminator 2, thank god. But they mix that with Fallout 3 style gameplay. And if you're like me, that's all you need. Give the game a try. I'm DHG, if you like my content, do subscribe. Mark's about to pass out. We need to stop soon. Okay, we'll do that. I don't think we've been properly introduced. I'm Ryan. That over there is Eric. She's a doctor of the group. Jennifer's a scavenger, and Colin, well, you can ask him yourself what this he This is the censored I'm version of the game. I'm a private from the Resistance. Pacific Division. Pacific. I looked into trying to get, trying to uncensor the sex scenes that happen later on in the game. They're completely optional, but trying to get in touch with the South Division. I couldn't find any way to, any type of mod or anything that uncensors it. So, playing through it as it is. It was something else. Then what was it? To be honest, I'm not sure myself. God damn it! That's as far as this piece of shit will go. Let's get off the road. Pull up over there. We got some time on them, so let's not lose our heads. I'll be on the fucking lookout for tin cans. Aaron, you do what you think is best for Mark. I'll see what I can do about the bus. Jacob, it might take a while, so... Can you look inside and see if it's safe to stay? Sure. Jennifer, would you help me? Sure. Alright, this game's got a specific structure layout. In between your main missions where you go out in the field, so to speak, you come back here to some type of a hub. This is the hub for now. Later on you get like resistance headquarters, things like that. But there's things to gather here. You can trade, get ready for the next mission, because once you're out in the field, th there's not really any trading. I don't remember anything, at least. Once you upgrade your skills, there's like areas to walk, pick in here. Like right here. Right now, I'm taking anything I can get. I'm playing this with a gamepad, obviously. The controls are a little wonky, but they work. Another lockpick door. Hey, one eye. I've been patient for the sake of this group. But you had one job today and you dropped the fucking ball. I don't have to listen to this shit. Sure, walk away, asshole. <laughs> I don't have to listen to this shit and just walks off. Can't blame him. So it is. I'm 
I'm pretty sure you find crafting tables out in the missions. That'll work. I'm pretty sure the lockpick mechanic is pretty much just lifted from Fallout 3. Yep. What do we got here? An AR-15? Ooh-wee. All this for us? Oh, did I startle you? Are you always such an asshole? You know what? Now that I think about it, I guess I am. Since we're stuck here, I figured I'll go see if anything's creeping around the corner. I hear that you're looking for the resistance, and where I'm heading, they used to have an outpost. I wouldn't mind backup while I'm out there. So what do you say? Buddies? Oh yeah, we're Talk BFFs. I'm moving out now. Let's meet at the bridge. And don't make me wait, will you? You won't like me when I'm impatient. Take my AR-15 here. This might come in handy. Mid kit. Pipe bomb. Pipe this grenade. Hey, thanks for earlier. And for you, I probably would have started completely freaking out. And that wouldn't have done anyone any good. Patrick's been through a lot, you know? I guess we all have. I just wish I could find something that would take his mind off all this. At least for a moment. Side quest. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Not a toy. I think that's a reference to Terminator 2. Were there any resistance in Pasadena? They were stationed just outside of town since I can remember. But they moved not that long ago. We tried to convince ourselves that maybe we were safe so they didn't need to be there anymore. But apparently we were wrong. What about your father? What happened to him? He protected us from a tin can. We were able to sneak out, but he had no chance. When I look back, he was lying there, dead on the floor. I'm sorry, I, I don't think I'm ready for this. Now the last time I played through this, they were still patching the game up. Hopefully they got all the bugs out of it, because... I ended up getting some corrupted save files. It made the game quite bad, quite hard to progress through. Hopefully that's not a problem this time. Seems a repair might take a couple days. How's it looking inside? There's a lot of supplies there. Looks like someone left them for us. Nah, seems too much of a convenience. You better keep your eyes open. I'll but keep them shut. Supplies, we don't have much, but we keep everything useful inside this crate. You feel free to look through and pick up what you need. Listen. I know that finding the resistance is your number one priority, but if you stumble upon a set of tools while you're out there, please bring them to me, okay? I must have lost mine during the escape. Good luck out there. Tools for a tool. No, he's not a tool. Why do they always have to look like spiders? Oh, she was the chick I rescued uh, in the last level. What have we got in here? Oh yeah, this is where I uh, swap out supplies. Here's my shit. Crafting stuff. What do you got? Can I sell that? Yeah, I don't need two weapons that shoot the same bullets. The 1911 and the Uzi. Although they don't share the same bullets in real life. That fires a 9mm, that a 45 ACP. Unless you get one of those staccato 2011s, they fire a 9mm, but this is not it. 
I really don't think I need anything at this moment, but an extra med kit never hurt. Can I help you? Can you? What was that with Colin? He was supposed to take care of a package back in Pasadena. Relying on him cost me my antibiotics, my pills, and possibly that man's life. But there's nothing we can do about it now. What do you think about Ryan? Ryan? I heard him fumbling through that speech back in the bus. You have to excuse him. Usually Jennifer's father welcomed the new arrivals. I guess Ryan thinks he has a new role in this group. Oh, you ain't doing it. We should all be worried. Do you need help with anything? No, I'm fine. I had to learn to do things by myself for quite a while, sweetie. Now, tell me what did you really want to ask me? How did you know about the Annihilation Mine? I heard the rumors, like everyone else. And then, like everyone else, I decided to ignore them. I was in the middle of operating on a little girl. When I had finished, I realized that we were surrounded. The machines killed most of us, but they decided to keep me alive. So, that's how I ended up in a camp. Maybe they thought it would be worth having a doctor in there. I don't know. What happens at those camps? People get tortured, experimented on, cut to pieces. I couldn't watch at first. But I soon realized that I had to do what no one else could. I had to bear witness to the atrocities. You were actually the first person that wasn't afraid to ask. They're all scared of me, like, like I'm carrying some sort of disease. Are you? But they're still coming to me for medicine. Ironic, isn't it? She appreciated that. All right, let's get the fuck out of here and start the mission. The weapon wheel. Yeah, I've never seen one of them before. This is Rivers over. Yeah, yeah, I see you. I found myself a lookout spot. No sign of any tin cans so far. A couple of crawlers, but nothing you can't handle. I don't know if this thing's automatic or single shot. It does say M16, which would imply that it's got select fire capabilities. Oh, a save game. Before I get my character leveled up, I'm probably going to be going through those health kits like, like a fat kid going through Twinkies. Area map. Yep, that's a map all right. Okay, now how the mission structure is laid out is you can go around do the side quests as you can see here. But other than that, it's pretty much an open world once you get out into the field, so to speak, and away from the hideout. There's a lot of shit to see, so I'm going to be dividing these videos up in between, you know, having the time at the hideout first and then going out into the field, which may take multiple videos for each out in the excursion out into the field. I think I know that. The way you're shooting, I thought you'd need all the advice you could get. It's a dead end, boy. Are you sure you want to waste everyone's time? How about you shut the fuck up?
There's got to be something back here. Developers always put things in the nooks and crannies. What do we got in here? Not that way. Explosive materials, small caliber ammo, medium caliber ammo. I can tell the devs don't know anything about guns. The bullet that the AR-15 and the M-16 shoots is, well, AR-15 <coughs> can shoot a lot of different types of bullets, but it's primarily the 5.56. It's not exactly what you would call a large caliber round. In fact, it's quite small. It's a 22. That was the requirements that the U.S. Army had for it. Had to be 22 caliber. Had to be capable of doing a lot of other things, too. And apparently it worked so well that both Russia and China made their own versions of it. China with the 5.8. And Russia with the 5.45. I think there's another one above me. Yep. Heal up, bitch. He's right there. Wait for him to move right beside there. I'm not here. You didn't see anything. Returning to patrol protocol. Couldn't tell if I was crouched or not. Come on, go over to the damn plasma container. You big old bitch. Oh, you fucker. There's another way in. I think there's another broken wall. Oh yeah, I forgot about these. Isn't there another armored spider patrolling this area? Yeah, there is. How do you throw the pipe bomb? Let me guess. Right bumper. Correct. What do you got in here? A couple old playboys. Trade resources, canned goods, all frank and beans. Looks like <laughs> ancient beer. Probably lager. Went bad years ago. If it were imperial stout, it would still be good. Okay, so it damaged them.
and turn around. There we go. What have we got in here? Let's do some dumpster diving, huh? Bottle of pills or whatever that was. Okay, now what was in here that was so important? Your lock picking skill level is too low. God, I got a bug bite on my arm and that thing is so fucking itchy. Ugh. I was just wondering if that was one of those trailer doors I could blow up. It's not. An icon will come up on your mini-map when you're near one of them. And my mini-map says no. I thought maybe it would fall apart. Digital Hoarder. I had to re-record part of the first episode yesterday because, like, the first three minutes was just all black. And I looked at my resource monitor and I was a little surprised. This game uses up on max settings, which I'm playing on. I'll show you here. Epic! I have a 60 hertz monitor. I don't care to go above that, ever. But I was surprised to see that this game was using like 16 gigabytes of VRAM. Maybe that's why it was a little... Didn't play so steady last time I tried to play through this. I think I had a 580RX at that time with... Eight gigabytes of VRAM. It was either that or my 1080 GTX. I don't remember. They both had 8 gigabytes. A dog. Sounds like it's up above me. Let's unlock this shortcut here. Okay, let's shut it again. Big Jeff's, home of the Big Bun Burger. Those prices ain't bad. Gratuity? No thanks, you smell like an ashtray. What a dick. Although they put the wrong punctuation mark in there for the total. They put a comma instead of a period. Oh, there we go. I was looking for a staircase. This works. I 
don't got the skills. I didn't even know the staircase was here. I walked right past it. It's locked from the other side. Yeah, but I'm busy hoarding. Nobody in the shitter. What are you doing here, boy? I know a kid that'd take care of you. Come on. Yeah, he just carries hey, a dog fuck with him. Your radio's on. I don't know dog breeds, but German Shepherd, I'm guessing. <laughs> look at that! He kind of looks like you. What a douchebag! Where was the other side quest? All the way up there. Tools for Ryan. Tools for a tool bag. I want to get rid of this roving patrol here. Beautiful. I saw something shimmering. It was nothing. Oh, but there's something here. A duffel bag filled with sweaty used socks. Yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm not wasting a pipe bomb. Not this early in the game, anyway. Some might be up here. Nope. Damn, my lock picking skill, or my lack thereof. 
I thought there was a way to get up there. Guess not. Self division has definitely been here. Pipe grenade. What's in here? Maybe a shotgun. A mini nuke? Nope. Just some ammo. Second spot. Maybe they're there. Whatever. Take another one. I can sell that one. Don't need any of that right now. Oh, wait. Health kits. How many of them do I have? Whatever. I'll make more. Skills. I need to get more skills. Lock picking. Oh yeah, I need that. I do believe that crafting comes in handy at some point here. I'm not big on stealth. I kind of like to just go out and start shooting. I've never been a fan of stealth games. Like, ever. Creepy little dolls. Some douchebag came up with a bright idea to use mannequins for target practice. It's fucked up, if you ask me. I just don't like the idea of shooting something with a face. Plus, they creep me the fuck out. Me and Joker were keeping watch yesterday. It was so dark we couldn't even tell the difference between one of the mannequins or a Terminator. They look too much like humans. I'm always on guard around those fuckers. Joker said, Now you know how me and the guys feel. You gingers are blurring the line between man and machine. You have no soul and you're rusty all over. What a fucking comedian. Gingers, huh? Reminds me of that South Park episode. goodies in here. Shit, I got a lot of pipe grenades right now. Pipe bombs, pipe grenades, whatever. You weren't here before. It's the only one. back and pick those locks. This one's just a shortcut. I think I get experience for picking these anyway. So it's not worthless. Yep. 
Yep, you get experience, okay. Just like Fallout 3. Oh, it's above me. Alright. Some of the weirdest looking steps ever. What do you got in here? Where'd you grab that? Out of the shitter. Kinda thought there'd be more in here. Keep calm and reload. Oh yeah, Remington shotgun. Better than nothing. So they got the rib site, yep. Just grunt to the mic a couple times. Time just stops while you're lockpicking. So used to hitting Y to swap weapons. Oh no, I've been detected. Let's blow this up for fun. Did I just pick up toothpaste? God, my med kit back.
all those goodies. I thought I was already in here. A shoe store. A little family owned shoe store. World News. When a spokesman for Russia's Ministry of Atomic Energy was asked about the origin of the seismic event that took place at a Russian nuclear test site about two weeks ago, he responded by saying, I don't know what seismic activity you're talking about. Russia has voluntarily discontinued any nuclear testing and has stuck to this decision. Yeah, I can destroy this shit from up here. Is that thing gonna chase me up here? Ah, I shut the door on you, bitch. He's like, I'll get it another way. I thought that was recoil. I'm like, why the hell is recoil going downwards? No, it's just locking me onto this area. None. None at all. I saw something there. I think this place is thoroughly looted. Can't go up there. Can't hack. Shit, what the fuck am I... Damn. 